Hey everybody, welcome to SMP Off Road. Um, the 95 XR8 Tickford that uh, we're hopefully getting ready for power cruise in September. We'll see how we go. She's got a lot of work to do. Um, she is running. There's a video um, posted a while ago, so go check that out if you want to see her come alive and actually start up. So we've been working a lot on the interior. As you can see, good old previous person painted pretty much every vinyl and plastic bit in the car. Um, so I've been working on the interior. Um, for those that are and might follow along, um, I'm Tori. I'm helping um, Justin, the owner of SMP Automotive and SMP Off Road, um, try and get this car ready. So the whole dash is painted red, um, and with it being vinyl, obviously we can't really use any too harsh products to get that off. So just going with the slight scraper, um, get that done and dusted. Um, here's a little bit of a satisfying video just on this last little patch. Um, got that all scraped off. Um, so in this interior, we're just trying to get everything back to as normal or original color as we can. Um, so yep, smashing out the dash, the, um, white surround, that's really, really thick white paint. Um, but here we go. Last little bit. Oof. Beautiful. And then we got the rest to go. It's a little bit anticlimactic there, but Hey. Um, so yeah, this is a white um, dash face that's really, really thick paint. So I'm not too sure what we're going to do with that. Maybe it's going to have to go black because um, I don't know if we're going to be able to recover that original color. Um, these are the pillar plastics or roof plastics, I guess you could say. I'm not too sure of correct terminology. I'm not the mechanic or the car person here. I'm just helping out. Um, so these, yeah, again... Don't want to get too harsh with the chemicals on this these, but um, I did actually, I brought them home with me and I actually did take a little bit of um, mineral terps to them. It did dry out the plastic a little bit, but um, just went in through with a um, trim detailer afterwards just to recondition those plastics. And you'll see in the last video at the end um, that they did actually still end up coming up pretty good. So... Yeah, follow along, guys, if you're interested. This is just obviously part one of probably a gazillion. So have a gander, have a watch, um, and like and subscribe and join the journey. And hopefully we'll have this one up and running for Power Cruise September and maybe see some of you there if you're heading out. All right, cool. Thanks, guys.